So I did mention uh, that I do have another uh, very special interview happening. I don't normally do this, uh, but you know, when special things happen on the store up, you got to make some exceptions. And tonight is one of those nights where we're going to make an exception. We do have DJ EFN from uh, Drink Champs yeah, yeah. in <laughs> studio with us tonight. Thank you for having me. Thank you so much for coming through. You're also here with your, your colleague you mentioned. Yeah, Recognize of Mayday, the good Mayday. DJ Recognize uh, from Mayday. Thank you so much for coming he's through. He's a DJ also. I yeah. DJ he's also. A I'm, mostly, I'm an MC by <laughs> trade, but I do okay. DJ as well. Yeah, you could DJ okay. your parties if you want. All right, all right. So he does you're, bar mitzvahs also. Oh, okay, clearly. You know, man of many trades. What else yeah. do you do? Do you like stand on one foot, juggle uh, at the same oh, time? Yeah, all of that. You know? He has Whatever twins he now, so he's a... Uh, I'm doing all that. Yeah, I got twins. Oh, so you really are. 18 months old. Yeah, I got twins that are 18 months old. So okay. I do pretty much everything right now. Nice, nice, <laughs> nice. Okay, well, welcome to South Africa, firstly. Thank you, Thank Thank you very uh, much. So excited to actually have you in studio. Why exactly are you actually in South Africa in the first place? Because, you know, um, of all kind of uh, countries you guys have visited, right. what kind of drew you to come to SA? Well, this is why it was important that he sit down on this interview because... Mm-hmm. I mean, we wanted to come to South Africa regardless in our series. Uh, I don't know how much you know about the series, but yes. Coming Home is a series, and this is the sixth film in the series, that we go to different countries and we document our travels and, and learning about the country through hip-hop culture. Yes. And usually we tie it in with something from, we bring somebody back or something that ties in something from us to that country. Yes. So I went to Cuba. I'm Cuban-American. Mm-hmm. My family's Cuban. I went to Cuba and I was following my roots. That's why, hence the name Coming Home. Okay. We went to Peru. We took one of our producers from Miami that's Peruvian. We went to Peru. Haiti. Took a friend of Haiti. Say, you know, yada, yada. Well, recognize he, his father is from Cape Town. Oh, dope. But he, he's okay. never been to South Africa. Wow. Why? Yeah. He left well, welcome home. Well, thank yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's taken me like my whole life to get here. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah, I've been yeah. my he, my father left when he was a child. He moved okay. to England. I was born in England. All right. And I moved to the states, and I've been in the states ever since. Okay. And I've been trying to find a way to get back here. Watching his movies, I told him, "Yo, if okay. South Africa ever comes up yes. on the list, sign me up." And yes. Here we are. Yeah. And here you are in South Africa. Have you enjoyed the journey? How long have you been here? I think you've been here for a few days. Three days now. Uh-huh. We're we're lost in time because of the travel time yes. and the hours of difference. So. Isn't that a bit crazy for you also uh, to still need to reach? out to people back home you know kind of get things done yeah. but yeah you're, you're now in a different kind of time zone yeah it's absolutely you know what I mean? nuts yeah i have a, a small child so calling my girl and finding you know yes. checking up it's like hey it's too early or it's too late yes you know? i can imagine i can imagine but um I, i'm loving the fact that you guys have actually decided to bring this to south africa um i heard it's award-winning um you guys have obviously been going through to different countries obviously uh, trying to see what else is happening in the different countries what have you experienced in south africa that you want to take back home I mean, as of right now, it, it's just the camaraderie of hip hop. Mm. It's like we're, it's we have we found it in every country, and yes. it's just I'm scared to not find it in a country. Let's just say that. Really? Yeah, I'm hoping that it stays that way because you know, as as hip hop gets bigger and more commercialized or whatever, mm-hmm. you know, I don't have anything against the commercialization of hip hop. Yes. But I do feel that you know it's an art form, and I like mm-hmm. to see it in its purest forms. And yes. I'm trying to see what of the elements, whether it's b-boying, graffiti, DJing, mm-hmm. MCing. Um, what elements in each country thrive the most. Like in Mm. Vietnam, the dance, you know, the B-boys and the B-girls were thriving more than anything. What do you think the kind of differences or the changes have been in the hip-hop community to kind of get us to where we are today? Do you think um, things have vastly changed or do you think like the the basics of hip-hop are still kind of there? You mean here or over there or in general? Well, in general, I think because now the culture is no longer only belonging to the United States. It now belongs to the world. I think that the culture as a whole, some it seems that when we go to other countries, they are more into the culture side of it, the art form in terms of all the elements. Mm. They respect that hip hop is, see rap is the music of hip hop, mm. but everybody says hip hop, they think of rappers. Yeah. But um, it's not, it's really a full on culture with its own dancing, the DJing, the MCing, you know, there's a, the whole shenanigans of it. So. I just believe that when these other countries, they they really believe more in the art form and the culture, and they want to adhere to it. So like the what they got from the states early on and how we were practicing it, mm-hmm. they're trying to stick to that, and yeah. they kind of look at the states as we kind of maybe you know dropped off or sold out. Really? Yeah, I mean that's what kind of consistently in every country that they've been telling us. Has it been an, a, a difficult task to, for you to actually put these documentaries together? Because sometimes you obviously need to get. Um, cooperation from people obviously you're trying to get certain things uh recorded maybe some people are a little bit you know edgy about um 
actually being on the documentaries right. how easy has it been for you to actually jump from country to cu country to actually get this done well i usually have great people on the ground that help me here mm. salama writes tyler these two guys have been great in helping us you know talk to people before we got here and we have this whole spiel where we just tell people like talk to us because you feel it's mutually beneficial you know yes. learn about who we are and and if you don't want to talk to us cool no problem mm -hmm. you know to us it's 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 just we just want an organic mutually beneficial process mm -hmm. and it's since we've been here it's been nothing but great vibes nice. a lot of love from everybody we've met you also found another MC who you uh, brought with you into studio tonight can well, you he brought us to the studio oh tonight. really <laughs> okay okay this is his, this is his home so I've got a I've got a, well introduce yourself sir D Yo, what up, what up? Formerly known as Sledgy Lee, but yeah, my name is Salema Wrights. Salema Wrights. Okay, yes. give us a little bit of a background as to who you are and uh, what your vibe is. Um, yeah, well, uh, you know, I'm just like, a, a, I'm a local MC, but then I'm also well well known for winning, winning a world championship of freestyle at the end of the week. Nice. Also won um, the Shiznes mixtape competition nice. in 2014. Well, we also had another WhatsApp uh, just to kind of add to this question. Mm -hmm. Obviously, he's asking about female rappers in South Africa, but there was another WhatsApp asking about South African hip hop as a whole and kind of uh, what your take is on right. on that. So, uh, do you want to? Yeah, I mean, we we got to meet. Uh, we had the honor of meeting uh, Gigi Lemayne that, yes. that was here. So she's the. F is that, that did I say her name correct? Yes, Gigi you Lemayne? did. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> um. So and she was dope. Um. And what's funny is that with our films, some of the best MCs we've met have been female MCs. The girls, yes. In general, I think hip-hop needs more women. Yes. All right, so we're going to get straight into the hard part here on 5FM. Uh, we're going to get into uh, the freestyle. Um, so what MC and DJ recognize is going to give us a, a taste of what he's got as well as Salema, who's going to be repping South A for us here tonight. It's been quite a ride so far. Let's recognize. Hey, check it out. Hey, Miss Cosmo. Listen, recognizes in the house to rock though, off the top flow. Listen, when I locked though, I just came to hear it and I rocked a hip hop show. Drank a couple bottles, labels blacker than my socks though. I just came to rock now, do it for my people. I let them know it's recognizing, yes, there be no equal. Hey. When I come into the studio, yes, I came to rock. I let them know they're coming home, South Africa, a one stop shop. Hey, I heard now, they give me mic, it's crazy. Ladies got a month, I think they need a lifetime, baby. Hey, you know I came to rock the exercise. It just be your boyfriend Mayday Miami is recognized Hey, I chrome these battles like Gattaca I let them know that I just batter ya In South Africa hey. I'm trying to do it now I rock it now I've hit the clips I'm trying to hit and visit every single township uh, You know it's wreck I got them bars It's strange music in the house I'm going extra far I do it now You know I how to do it in the cut It's freestyling these bars I got it for the stirring up Let's go, yeah, yeah Yeah ha. What the yeah, yeah, what up? Salute DJ Ear, fan of Drink Champs. I'm in the whole Miami team. Salama rights on the microphone. Salute Miss Cosmo, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, about to do it like this, you know what I'm saying? Uh, okay, yes. Ha, uh, one, two. Check it. I spit the fire with force, inspire your loss, retire your boss Plus I come from a long line of freedom fighters in wars When my pops was on house arrest, he would still slide from the porch Long before I was born, I was trapped inside of these bars When my timer was my age, he wasn't riding with dogs The devil's inside of your laws, he was riding with gods And not because of religion, apartheid was the cause So even though I'm not a Christian, I'm a child of the cross My mom's was also in the struggle, fighting for mines and for yours Defying and raw, kill a devil behind the door My pops must have seen the universe inside of my ma Queens line up with gods I'm a child of the stars Born as a young god Trying so hard Fighting the odds Learning that the only thing That come from violence is scars Getting dumb buzzed inside of the club Riot and scorch Nobody knows the hunger pain That draws inside of my heart Divided we fall Snitches try to divide us in parts United we stand United even inside of the courts Cause we broke But government keep heightening the cost And the world is trapped in darkness But my mind is the torch Bring light to the lost Like five four fours Firing off Politicians don't walk the walk, I'm getting tired of talk Keep saying that we free, but they lying with George He took freedom to Iraq, now they dying in scores Slave drivers use whips, keep us in line with their laws Trump fast with the whip like he was driving a Porsche I damaged the whip, cause when I ride, I ride it off Slave drivers ain't even safe when they inside their garage No time to try sliding off, break down your tires and parts Life is harsh, leave you with partial little pie that you floss I'm the truth, all these brothers do is lie like a corpse I'm fly like a hawk, keep it martial like a Chinaman's arts I 
love women so as soon as I stepped inside of the yard She untightened her shorts, asked me if I'd like a massage But I ain't married, you know, I'd like to yeah. I'm married to the microphone, she ain't like all these broads Got on my t- and popped the question, no time for a pause Told the wrist around me, your whole cypher revolves Up all night, writing you bars Cause you up all night, telling me other rappers is liars and frauds Since I was nine, I've been inside of my thoughts Ten more years, it'd be twenty-four Think of you when I recite twenty-fours Don't trip, ma, the condom stay inside of the drawers And when it comes to microphones, I'm used to grinding it raw Don't stop though, they say I got a dark flow And hey, yo, how you say you gon' switch, but you not hot though me, I spit it and I spit it. Tell them niggas stop though. Why? Because they not doing it on Miss Cosmo. 5FM. Watch 5FM TV on YouTube. 5FM.